The nature of the game is such that it happens at the speed of life, and the things that we face in golf challenge us in ways that tests our perseverance. It challenges our confidence. And when you can give confidence in golf, it gives them confidence to try those things off the golf course. A lot of the things that I, I coach in golf really take people out of their comfort level. And you know, a lot of life is learning how to deal with things that are out of your comfort level. And so when you can overcome a challenge in golf, you can easily apply it to life. One of my main goals in coaching is to help my students take what they learn on the practice facility and just seamlessly blend it out on the golf course. The activities that I design are to help you actually experience the game as opposed to have to think about it, process it, and then have it be an interference on the golf course. It's really awesome when people come in with an old pattern and I'm able to introduce them you know, a new possibility and they, you can see that that clicks. And once that clicks and kind of the light bulb goes off, that's, a, that's an amazing moment. And then of course now the, the work starts to create, the, let this new possibility become the new pattern. And you know, oftentimes that takes months and sometimes even years with people, but it's awesome when it first, when it first connects. I love that moment. And then I love the fact that we're gonna have to work together to create this new possibility, to make new habits, to make a new pattern start to take over. What makes golf really special is it challenges you in so many unique ways. I mean, it has, it has so much to offer as an aesthetic quality. It's in beautiful places and beautiful parts of the world. But the, the game itself, you have to kind of create it as it goes. It's not, it's, it, it, it's not reactive, per se. It's that you have to dig down deep within yourself. You have to manage personality traits and your own characteristics to bring out the best. It's one of the best blend of how the mental and the physical have to work together. And you now that's, that's one of my favorite parts of the game. And that's why it's so much fun to coach, is it's never ending what you have to get, what you have to get better at. There's always something. Now, a cornerstone of my own philosophy is that there really are no physical mistakes. They start in the mind. They start with self-interference. And so you know, learning, you know, learning new swing patterns and swing skills very, very essential, and I spend a lot of time on that, but I never skip the step, or I never, I never fail to recognize that the mental game is always going to override the physical game. So certain mental states, like if you're nervous, if you're tense, your swing isn't gonna be the same um, than when you're in your optimal state. And having students recognize that from the very get-go, I think is one of the reasons that people seek me out. I'm Dan Martin, and I love exploring the possibilities in your game.